Dave. Obviously, uh, putting McDavid and Drysaddle together paid huge uh, uh, dividends today. So, I mean, uh, obviously, coaching was the difference in this game. <laughs> no, that's those, those players are the ones that make the the difference in the game. And we just we talked about it last night as a staff and uh, our last couple games at home against them. We had some success with that line together, so we went back with it tonight. shooters in this league and teams they kind of have to leave him open a little bit because if he doesn't McDavid has more time and space I mean that's got to be an awful predicament for uh, opposition teams to uh, find themselves well they're, they're both they're both elite players and they make plays and you know Dreisaitl shoots it as well as anybody especially quick off the pass and uh, so they they play off each other well and uh, you know they find opportunities and they you know they capitalize on some opportunities that are they're not they're kind of not normal goals they're they're what top top players do and that's you know we're fortunate that they capitalized a couple on those tonight Mark Spector, Sportsnet. Hey, Dave, uh, it's hard to tell off the With, uh, with McDavid and Drysaddle? No, I think it was just in the middle of a change. Okay, I want to ask about Cassidy's game. He's pretty quiet, man. He's got a lot of points. He was, of he was, uh, he's not bad tonight. He played, uh, uh, we played him on left wing tonight. We're going to try some different things. We've been talking to him. He was, uh, his game was better tonight than it was the other night in Montreal. Is that the kind of game that, that your team, it doesn't hurt your team, playing a feisty opponent that, that push back and hit back? And no, that's good. Of, that, that, Ottawa works. You know they're going to work. If you're not willing to work, you're uh, you're going to be behind. So they drag you into the drag you into the game. And uh, you know I thought I liked our lines tonight. We had everybody that played, and uh, and you know you you know you got to work. So it's uh, that's the kind of game it was going to be. And ultimately, you know McDavid and Drysaddle made a couple of real good plays for us to to give us an advantage. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, we're talking to uh, Leon and Connor. They gave me the idea that uh, a lot of times uh, when you're going to the dynamic duo, uh, that uh, they don't find out about it till the morning skate, although they can sense it coming in some cases. Uh, with their record this year against Ottawa, uh, was that pretty much a no-brainer? Well, they haven't. You know, that's our eighth game. They There was games the first... Uh, Three or four, I don't think they played together. But the last set that we had at home there, the last three we had at home, I think we had them together. So it's, uh, you know, we you go back and you look at some of those tapes and you try to figure out what you think might work and what not. So tonight we just decided to put them together and and uh, fortunately we got some results. Uh, now you got one more game to play against them tomorrow night. Uh, what's the challenge involved? Well, you know, you got to show up and work because they're going to work. They they drag you into the work ethic of the game, and if you're not working, you're going to be behind. So we we have to make sure we get some rest tonight and show up and make sure we got our work boots on tomorrow because it's uh, it's going to be another tight game that um, you know you're going to have to work to to find a way to win if you got a chance to win. Jim Austin, Post Media. Uh, Dave, uh, how did you think Turris played this season? I, I thought they were all right. That line they banged around, had some shifts down in the offensive zone. Turris had a good chance on the on on a, a power play. So, you know, we'll see. We're, we're lots of lots of moving parts right now. So we'll see where that goes. But uh, they were all right tonight. That line. You talked about Ottawa's competitiveness. How did you see the, uh, the Brady Kachuk Leon Dreisaitl? A little bit of a dust up there. Is that just the way? Uh, yeah, I, I, I didn't see it down in the corner. It was the one in the corner I couldn't see, but that's just part of the game. That's you got teams competing. That's what's going to happen. Daniel from Bowman, the Athletic. Dave, uh, you, you seem to give your your second power play unit a little bit more ice, including starting them in one uh, power play. What, what did you think of that unit that you put together? Yeah, they, they had a chance. They, you know, McDavid and Drysaddle were out there for a minute and thirty. And just had, had come off another power play, so we just we wanted to give them a breather. So uh, we put them out there. They had a good chance. Tourists had a good chance. Uh, so it's uh, 
it's good to get some people other looks there, and uh, they were fine tonight. Nico Koskinen was coming off, uh, you know, as everyone did in Montreal last week, not a very good uh, performance. And how did you think he, he rebounded? Uh, he was solid, really yeah. solid. You know, we gave up a couple chances at the end there. He made big saves for us, so timely saves. And, uh, you know, he played really well in here last time he played in here, so it's... Uh, uh, we thought he would give us a good game, and uh, and he came up and played very well. Final question, Ryan or Shog, TSS. Yeah, just on uh, Drysdale's second goal there. I mean, you know, to thread the needle the way he did from where he did. Uh, just maybe, if you can, put into perspective how how hard a shot that is to make and how, how impressive that is. Well, first of all, most guys wouldn't even attempt that shot, so you're not going to see it very often, but. You know, he's uh, that's the kind of player he is. He has that confidence. Not only can he can he try it, he's successful at it. So yeah, it was a heck of a shot. It's just one of those ones that catches the goalie and and uh, pretty small space to fit it through. But he uh, he found a way. Would you uh, have ever shot a puck from there? Can you recall ever? <laughs> ever that? I dumped a lot of pucks in the corner there. I probably I might have tried to <laughs> shot one there, but uh, no chance of going in. Thanks, yeah.